Happy Vlogtober day two. I am done with work and venturing out for some lunch. I opted for the margarita pizza, one of my favorites. All right, lunch was very tasty. I had the margarita pizza and a baguette and it was pretty good. So uh, it is about 1.20 and I have an hour drive to my next town. And then I'm pretty much done today, so I'm just gonna relax and I think I'm gonna play The Sims in my room. Um, I did not end up reading last night. After I finished uploading the video, I got kind of lost down the YouTube rabbit hole. I found a YouTuber who does videos on uh, <laughs> three very specific interests I have. Disney, uh, The Addams Family, <laughs> and uh, royalty, like, King Henry VIII and his wives and so I kind of got down her rabbit hole of all of her videos on her channel last night and then finally at like midnight I was oh, it was like 12 30 I was like okay I need, I need to go to bed now so uh anyway yeah so I'm gonna head to the next place now I just got to my next hotel and realized I didn't have my ID in my wallet so I panicked a moment and then I realized it was in my shorts that I wore this morning to breakfast so uh, don't know why I took it out of my wallet. I should never do that because I'm definitely prone to losing things when I get out of my routine. So anyway, I am here. There's a gift shop here and there are some uh, pretty golden magnets. and some taffy, which I'm trying to resist the urge. The main reason I'm not is because they are not assorted. If I had a mix, I'd probably get it, but you know, I'm really tempted by the caramel though. Welcome, monsieur. Sit yourself down and meet the best innkeeper in town. As for the rest, all of them crooks rooking the guests and cooking the books. My friend Karen texted me because someone used the term cooking the books at her work and she instantly thought of Master of the House friend Les Mis. Obviously she had to text me. I immediately identified with that and had to pause my podcast to take a listen. I am not going to tell you how many takes that took. And this is my Sims laptop. I travel with this just so I can play The Sims. It's all I use it for. So here's my game. I have uh, quite a few families kind of spread out throughout all the different neighborhoods. One of my favorite pastimes is playing dolls virtually. I literally spend hours playing this game when I get into the zone. If I don't have at least three hours to play, I kind of feel like what's the point? Because it's not something I can just do for like an hour before I you know, move on to something else. So if I don't have a nice chunk of time, I kind of hold off and I haven't played it in a couple of days. So I'm excited to kind of get lost in the game tonight. Also, I think we need a drinking game for whenever I say I'm excited about something because it's ridiculous. I really like downloading houses from the gallery, which is basically an online community where people that create things in the Sims, whether it's individual Sims or they build homes, um, upload their creations and then you can download them into your own game. So this is the Pickles house from the Rugrats and um, I downloaded it and moved a family in. I am at an A&W. It's one of the old drive-in diners and I haven't been to one of these since a long time ago. Can I go ahead and take your order? That will be for here to go. That will be for here. Okay, you chose thirteen dollars. We'll have it out when it's ready. Thank you. Thank you. There was an A and W in my town growing up, and I remember liking it. We didn't go there very often, but it's closed, and now there's a bunch of A and W KFCs, but they're not very good. So I'm interested to see how this goes. Before coming to dinner, I had a really long conversation with one of my best friends, Rhonda. We talked for about an hour and 25 minutes, and we always do this whenever we call to catch up or have a quick story. It's usually that, oh, I just have a quick story. Do you have a minute? And then it's been 90 minutes, and it's like, oh, I should let you go. So uh, we just talked about anything under the sun, and it was wonderful. It's, it's, it always feels good to my soul when I catch up with friends and 
Uh, Rhonda is good people. Hello. All right, $13 even. Uh -huh. And you need your window up four inches. Okay. Perfect. Ah, you sorry. It. <laughs> it's a That's rental. A perfect window. How's that? <laughs> good. Okay. Cool. All right, so 13 even. Did you want a receipt? No, thank you. All right. Awesome. Thanks. As I'm sitting here enjoying my A&W drive-in experience, I thought I'd get on Wikipedia to do some research because I'm that guy. And it turns out A&W dates back to 1919, so it's like 100 years old. I'm celebrating its birthday. It's pretty good so far. The burger is very tasty. The chicken strips are just all right. And the french fries are kind of cold, but they are sitting outside in the rain. So what are you going to do? Well, that was very tasty. I have not enjoyed a and W in a while. So I am glad that I came and checked that out. After last night's dinner, I just kind of wanted something a little bit more low key. Um, and a little bit easier on the budget as well. I'm back at the hotel and I think I'm gonna play The Sims a little bit longer. Uh, it's about 7.30. Just kind of playing some of my families and making sure they're all lining up with the storylines I have in my head. It's really nice just to kind of escape from life and get invested in this. So I'm gonna do this for the next little bit and I will check in soon. Good morning, happy Vlogtober day three. I figured I would just kind of roll over to today because I only had like six minutes of anything useful from yesterday and uh, that's not really a good video length. So uh, we'll see how today goes. All right, all ready for lunch and I figured I would try this place called Best Thai Cuisine. So we'll see about that. My go-to is always the cashew nut chicken dish, although I might do it with beef today. All right, I went ahead and ordered the usual. I got beef with it, I got some fried rice, some spring rolls. Um, yeah, we're in for a treat, I think. The problem is they don't have baby corn, so I don't know, we'll see if they can still be the best Thai plate. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that was actually really good. Uh, the only thing is they don't have baby corn, but other than that, it was perfect. The flavors were great, the portions were good, um, very tasty. I haven't had Thai food that good in a long time. I had to stop and get gas. I have ran out once and come close a few times, so now I'm pretty, uh, pretty I try to be aware of it. We're stopped. There are cars coming from the other direction, so hopefully it won't be another 20 minute wait like it was a few days ago or yesterday or whenever it was. When was I here? They're just doing repaving of the road, so that's why we're all confined down to one lane, so I'm hoping that it won't be too long. It is 1.31 now, so we'll see how long this takes. I was only waiting for like two minutes and then traffic started moving, so that was wonderful because I did not want to sit there very long. Um, I just got checked into my hotel. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up some reports for today. Uh, I have to book like the rest of my travel for the month of October. Um, and then I think I'm gonna play The Sims a little bit more. You're having Buffalo Wild Wings? Mm -hmm. How is it? Good. I can see your car. Yep. I'm getting dinner too. What car are you in? A uh, Kia Soul. Yeah, I see you. No, he's not here. What are you doing, Tio? <laughs> Nothing. Yep, I'm heading to dinner myself, actually. It occurs to me that I've been here before. As I was pulling in, I realized I've, I've actually been here. So um, I liked it, I think. Hopefully. As I was pulling up, I totally recognized it. So I had come here on a date once upon a time. And I don't remember if I liked it, but I think I did. <laughs> I'm back from dinner. That was very tasty. And plot twist, I have never actually eaten there. I must have driven there with my date, tried to eat there, and then either they were closed or the line was too long, but I'm pretty sure they must have been closed. 
I have no recollection of going inside, um, and we ended up eating it somewhere else. So this dinner was very good. Um, the pasta was tasty. I just had a primavera pasta with a really creamy like vodka sauce, and then you saw the the caprese salad and the cake that I couldn't turn down for dessert. I'm just gonna wrap up a few things that I've kind of been putting off for the day, and then I am going to play The Sims. I thought I'd introduce you to the family that I've been playing. This is Natalie and her boyfriend, Dylan, and they are actually engaged to be married. Dylan is an artist. He paints during his free time, which is all of it because he does not have a real job. So he spends his days painting and some of his masterpieces are on display here. Um, he sells those and then Natalie is going to be a veterinarian. He's got a pretty sweet setup here, just listening to his tunes while he cranks out one painting after another. Apparently, being an artist is quite a lucrative endeavor. And they are engaged to be married, so I think tonight I'm just gonna play them up until they get married, and that's how I'm gonna wind down my evening. So I will say good night and Talk to you again tomorrow. Unit term Sabani. Okay, what about it? Uh,